Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and uh, this is another video to talk about uh, Microsoft Edge uh, stable version of course the Microsoft Edge browser that everybody has or almost uh, for those that are still left without it you will be getting it in uh, next patch Tuesday of April. Um, one of the things that is cool about the browser is its ability to actually have a web capture. Now, some of you might know that there's a uh, tool called a screen snip that enables you to take um, a snapshot of the screen. The problem with the screen snip is that it, it only takes the screen. If you have a web page that's long enough, you don't get the web page. You get just the uh, part that you have visible on your screen. So let's take, for example, this web page of spaceweather.com. It has a lot more to offer. So in Edge, you actually have a tool to do a screen capture of a full web page. How to do this? Simply go to the uh, upper right corner in the three horizontal dots, and you'll see here web capture. You can also to toggle, toggle the uh, screen uh, web capture with Control Shift S if you want. Once you do that, it will ask you free form. So you'll be able to select just the parts you want or full page, which will actually take the full page of your um, browser. So this means that if you actually want to see the full uh, extent of the page, you'll be able to do so with the web capture. And of course you can save the web capture in uh, your a computer in a JPEG with the little disk. You can share it with others. And here, if we open the file, you'll see that I have a full web capture. Now, this page was very long, but you could see that it actually has done a full web capture of all the page up to the bottom. Now, if you, of course, once again, just want to have part of it, but still bigger than what the screen has, then what you could do, let's start it again, here, we go back, we do the web capture, we just choose the free select which is automatic, and let's say I'm going to start here, and I'm going to do this like this, and take only this part here, and of course, that means that once you put here, I'm going to go here and slide down the page, you see here I can slide down, uh, say I want to stop here, just here. Let's go just here. Here we go. Copy. It's copied. You can actually do what you want with it. Say, for example, you want to edit with paint. You go to paint. And you go to paste here. And now you have in paint that part of the page that I have. And now with paint, you can do whatever you want. Uh, simply, you know, choose whatever you would like to uh, do. And the colors, and for example, and you can actually write over it if you want. So here's a color. Da -da -da -da. What a beautiful art. <laughs> so you can, you know, like I said, take the full page, take just uh, part of it, and you will just, you know, do what you want afterwards. Uh, it's a, a neat feature because uh, you can have, like I said, a full page, not just part of it like the screen snip does. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.